I guess. 11 degrees the temperature at noon. Notice we go from partly sunny to mostly cloudy. Clouds are going to just roar right in here and uh, we'll get up to around 15 for a high today. I'm, I'm keeping the severe weather index in the low category. Emily, you're right. She's dropping many things by the desk and laughing. That was hairspray too. Um, yes, yeah, severe weather index is at low, dry today, so we have no problems traveling around. There's a little snow on the forecast tonight, one or two inches, and then more snow on Monday, and that could be a much more major system heading our way. Lots of clear skies on our satellite view until you make your way into Iowa and Minnesota, and it's right along here, starting to see some snow pop up, and that's going to be our snowmaker later on. Now, I think based on the track of uh, this snow that it's actually going to move well to our southwest, our snowmaker will be up here towards International Falls, which is going to be dropping down and producing a little bit of snow. Future track agrees with me. Things pretty quiet by 5 o'clock, but I really think by 6 o'clock, especially starting in the north woods, you're going to see, see some snow flying. It's not going to be overly heavy, and it's going to be out of here by tomorrow morning. Tomorrow afternoon, a lovely day. If you have plans to be outdoors, whether you're trying to check out those snowy owls that are out and about or just hitting the ski hills, sunny, light winds, and temperatures really not bad for this time of year. And then here comes snow, part two. But that part two is going to be a lot more significant than part one right here. This is uh, tonight's uh, estimated snowfall total. It's only about an inch and a half in Green Bay, less than an inch in Oshkosh, and maybe up to two inches in Ocano, and maybe two and a half in Iron Mountain. But I think Monday we'll probably see three to six inches of snow. Other area temperatures, minus six in Marinette. You've got minus nine in Shano, minus five in Oshkosh, minus six in Fond du Lac. So today's high up to 15 degrees and again dry today. The snow doesn't start until the evening hours. Uh, overnight we're going to see one or two inches of snow and a low of five and then a high of 20 tomorrow. That'll be a pretty nice day. And then the commute on Monday, that'll begin to get snowy and I really think the commute home Monday afternoon, uh, that's going to be probably the worst part because we should top up between three and six inches across the region. Haven't named the storm yet, but I'm keeping a close eye on the storm track right now. There's some disagreement between the three and the six inches and how much we're going to get. The one thing I do know, though, we're going to get warmer highs in the 30s for most of next week. I can clap for that.